Hello everyone and welcome to episode 11 of Let's Play Quake 2. In this episode, let's see, uh, retrieve the airstrike marker. We're going to go onto the planet's surface. We're going to go into a part of it that is not heavily industrialized. Let's see if we can't nail this guy. Got him, okay. Now we're gonna be swimming through a lot of water for this episode. I noticed in the last episode the stuttering seems to happen whenever I go in water. It might happen in other times. I haven't been that close attention to it. I've been trying to ignore it since I cannot really seem to fix it. But for the most part I'm satisfied with how it comes out. It doesn't, I mean, the stuttering doesn't look that bad. It just doesn't look as smooth, you know? What I'm concerned with is the fact that Frap seems to record fairly darkly. And I have taken measures to make it less dark, but that only does so much. God, there's a lot of you guys. There's the marker we need. Okay, now let's go down into this water. There's, uh... Two things we can do in this water switch weapons. There we go. See, it started stuttering as soon as I got in the water. I think the engine, I think the uh, base Quake 2 engine might be struggling a little bit to do the animated water in this. There's a, going to be a lot of these sharks. Where we're going. See, there's more. Okay, there's one more. And three more. Let's go this way first. Because there's two different ways we can go in this. See, it doesn't seem to affect me nearly as much when I'm above water. Dead. Uh, let's go. Look at him swimming down here on the below the surface. I really like the uh, lighting effects. Like, if you fire a rocket down a hallway, the hallway will light up as it passes through it. And that's really cool to me. I really like that. And we got just killed three more. And uh, that's as far as we can go. Are all of you guys dead yet? Because I'm going to have to switch over to my shotgun because I'm running low on this ammo. The only way to get here is to go down here. If you try to do it with your head above water, you'll get stuck. So keep that in mind. I still have a little bit of... I still have a lot of shield, uh, but I don't have much in the way of armor. We're going to go up there and get that ammo when we go back up there. It's go over here this is the other place we wanted to go to in the water there's a little bit of ammo here and I think that's it yeah that's it let's resume mission when I did my practice run on the Xbox version of this game, I actually, so I did that, I played the Xbox version, the Xbox 360 version of this game for my practice run mostly so I could play it while I was just laying on my bed or whatever, sitting on my bed, comfortable in my own room. I'm playing the PC version for the Let's Play. Uh, 
but what I died a lot on this level. The I had uh, there are things about the Xbox version that aren't as good as the PC version. I mean, obviously, I mean the Xbox version looks great. It's by far the best console port of the game. I really like the way that it looks, but let's see if there's anything over here. But the aiming feels a little bit wonky at times, which isn't that big of a deal. Fight your way in here quickly, because you want to be in here when this goes off. Besides that, there's ammo in here, and. We like ammo and shit, right? Let's get that. Bandoiler. Computer updated. What does the computer say? Target destroyed, proceed to exit. Let's go see what it looks like now that it's destroyed. That looks pretty fucking destroyed. And it blew this door open so we can continue. Let's do that. And there's nothing behind here, so let's just press the exit button. It's time for a cutscene. Boy, we are fucking the strong shit up today. The cutscene was there was lagging a little bit behind the sound. For those of you who follow both my channels, you'll probably notice that I have uploaded myself playing this before. All I did was record some raw footage and upload that. But yeah, I have there is footage of me on my FS Metal channel playing through this portion of the game. There's no commentary, it's just me playing the game. But yeah, this is the last stretch of the game. We are just about done. Which is a good thing, I'm almost out of, uh... Well, actually, this level can be fairly long. Probably take another episode or two to finish it. I, it won't be today, I can tell you that much. We won't be finishing this game today. As you can expect, the Macron's palace. Uh, the Macron is the leader of the Strahd. And he's armed to the fucking teeth. As you can imagine, the Macron's palace is very heavily guarded. Like, we haven't even reached the main palace yet. And look at all the enemies bombarding us. Let's go back here. Uh, seven. Boom! It's a secret area back here, I believe. Let's go back out here. Yeah, I know, you're up there. You want attention. Let me come give it to you. Phrasing. 
We're gonna go kill this guy. Yeah, this is the la This is the final stretch of the game. Let's press that button. Let's see if we get Yes, okay. And press that button. A secret door has opened somewhere. Be careful with this. Got both of them, and I think there's a tank out here, so... Yeah. Let's get him square in the chest with that. Seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay, it takes ten rockets to take those guys down. That's how tough those sons of bitches are. And you can hear another tank coming for us. Obviously, be careful maneuvering around this corner because if you go back out here and you go back here, that happens. medic out here. Medic out here resurrecting everything. Drop you guys from the sky. Where'd that freaking medic go? Is he dead? Did I get him? Ow. Not even sure what happened there. Yeah, you can hear more of them. out yeah they're kind of pissed at me can you tell sounds like there may be more than one No, you don't. Got him. Okay. Jesus, there's another one. And another one. Am I full up on this? Because I'm going to take one of them out with this. Point blank. There's one, okay, got one of these things. You have to be extra careful. When fighting these things, especially when there's multiples. Thank you for missing me twice. Oh. Mm. 
No. Let's do this. There goes one. Two. These Icarus enemies are everywhere. And they all want a piece of me. Okay, let's go up and kill that one. That's up here. I think that just let... I think that just goes to deeper into the palace, so let's go down here. We jump across here, we don't. Okay. Keep this in mind. We will be coming back here later after we get further into the palace. We're going to backtrack. For a good reason, but we're going to backtrack. Shoot that broken gate, and let's go up here. Pick up the ammo. Ow. Yeah, you stay dead. Okay, we need this data disk, so let's pick it up. Let's go. Let's see if I can jump across this. I can. Awesome. Let's see what it say. Find communications laser data disk in Upper Palace. Well, we have to fight to the Upper Palace first. There's supposed to be a way to extend this bridge. Was there a computer terminal in here that I missed? Did that do it? That did something. I don't know what. You found a secret area. Okay, that extended that bridge. I knew there was a way to do it. Jump here. Jump here so you can get ammo. I did not get that ammo. And we're heading back. Again, keep this in mind. We will be returning to it. Eventually. Let's go up. Actually, real. I love this game, and I've thoroughly enjoyed this let's play. I hope you guys have too. And I'm getting near the end of it. I mean, we're in the end. We're in the outer palace, I think. That's overkill. Get the shells. Get that and that. Now there's going to be a series of of uh, force fields that you won't be able to pass through in this. And you're going to need to deactivate these force fields before you can pass through them. That's how the palace works. Let's go kill us another tank.
Come on, buddy. Come on. There we go. Now he's dead. And he gave me rockets. They can't get to me right now. I thought there was some kind of secret around here. I think there is, but... Let's drop down here. Obviously. That's what I was trying to do in the first place. Okay, I think this is the secret that I was thinking of, and I will get it after I kill this fucker. I didn't give you permission to shoot lasers at me. Secret area. Oh, there's a wall thing. You trespassed in front of my shotgun. Let's go up here. And we cannot pick that up. Evidently, we cannot shoot through those bars. Weird. We need to deactivate the force field first. Um... We didn't go this way, did we? We did go this way. Let's go this way then. There's stuff up there. That's... We don't need the stuff up there. You may notice that uh, the uh, railgun can shoot through enemies. So if you get the enemies lined up in front of it. Red force fields deactivated. That's good. If you get multiple enemies lined up and shoot them with a the railgun, it'll hit all of them. Glorious, right? I love that gun. You should too. You guys suck. I mean, you, you trespass in front of my gun. This is your fault. No, you don't. Yes, I do. I will get on that when I get the chance. Right now I'm killing the shit out of these guys. This is why, as I remember, this is one of the more non-linear sections of this game. Yeah, that's one of those uh, triggered sayings. Every single time you pass by there, he will say that.
stop hurting me. And I will stop killing you. It seems like a fair deal to me. Well, I don't want to use that gun. I'm gonna go back up here and I'm gonna kill that other one. Where are you? Get your ass around that corner. Shoot you four times. And you missed me. Got him. Right. I forgot about that. Yes, they literally placed that right in front of that guy. We heard you, dude. You know what? Here's how easy these guys are. I can kill them with this. There you go. That's how easy those guys are. I usually don't because it's time consuming, but I just thought I'd show that off. This is why these guys are a complete non-threat in this game. Obtain the data CD from the upper palace. Uh, go this way. This looks like where we can disable green lasers. Deactivated. Yep, green lasers lasers are deactivated. Let's go kill one more enemy in this uh, section of the game, and we can get down here now. Where we've already been. Let's go kill one more enemy in this section. And then we'll call it. We have a disable and destroy order on communication laser. That wasn't the enemy I was thinking of. Yes, dude, come out here. That is the enemy that I wanted to kill. Sweet. Found a secret. I heard you, dude. You don't need to keep telling me. This outcropping over here, let, let's call it here. Thank you everybody for watching this episode of Let's Play Quake 2. Please like, comment, and subscribe down below. It would be greatly appreciated, and I will talk to you guys next time. Thanks everybody, bye.